Hello guys, welcome and welcome back to my channel. My name is Vivian and today I'm going to take you to my local Arabic shop here in Falun. I filmed this on 2nd May this year and <laughs> I, this is one of the two shops that we have here in Falun, one of the two Arabic shops and they sell so many things here. Mostly Arabic stuff because it's an Arabic shop, right? <laughs> but as an African, I always go there to grab a few things that I really need and I can't find them in supermarkets here, like the Swedish supermarkets in court. So as you can see, they sell a lot of stuff. You can get beans, rice. <laughs> I mean rice in like bigger bags <laughs> you can get um, soap like the bar soap and then you can get the liquid soap as well we have spaghetti um, it's so many things here I, I, there are so many things that I, some of them I don't know their names maybe because they are written in Arabic <laughs> I don't know <laughs> As you can see, um, they really sell in bigger packages, which you might not be able to find in Swedish supermarkets. They sell a lot of uh, canned stuff. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I don't eat that, <laughs> but I just wanted to give you a little tour of the shop. Um, I don't want to talk a lot in this video. <laughs> I just want you people to watch and just see what we can get in this shop. As you can see, when I was filming, um, they were really running out of uh, stuff here. But they were bringing in some new, they were bringing in some big, big boxes. So they were, I think they were stocking uh, very soon. Maybe this week, they will be putting in some new stuff. Look. Um... And by the way, most of their stuff, uh, or most of the packages, uh, they have Arabic written on, which is quite hard for us who don't speak Arabic. But then some of their packages have Swedish written on, which makes it easier for us. At least we can read <laughs> Swedish. <laughs> well, if you've you know, been here for quite a while and you've learned Swedish, so it becomes easier, you know. Yep. Like I said earlier, look, most of their packages, like they give you um, the opportunity to choose. Do you want a small package? Do you want a bigger one? Like you look, uh, we have uh, five kilogram bags of rice and it's basmat rice. <laughs> yeah, this is a very big size. It's bigger than what you can actually get in Swedish supermarkets. Their packages are always small because they have smaller families. They are not like us. And actually, people from Middle East, they always have big families, just like us Africans. So that explains why they have bigger packages, you know. And here we have sausage. There you get um, um, some different parts of meat. I think those are legs i don't know if they're from cow or goat <laughs> or um sheep yeah they could be from sheep and then we have shrimps for those who eat shrimps <laughs> if you're a fan of seafood you know and then that could be a whole chicken they also sell chicken here and there it should be a head they're just heads of the goat 
<laughs> I think, but it's a head or their heads. And there we have some fried stuff. We have that chicken burger. And some more sausage for those who love sausages. Yeah. And that's my favorite part. It's the flour that I used to make ugali. <laughs> and you can use it to make porridge. Just add some milk and you'll appreciate me like that. Oh my god. And they have the yellow one, which here they normally say it's corn flour. And then they have the white one. We call it maize flour. So, so many things that you can buy. There they have uh, a variety of tea and then coffee with different flavor. So, yep. We got some fruits for the fruit lovers. We have fruits here. When you're lucky, you find, especially when they have just stocked, then you will buy a lot of, or you'll find a lot of fresh, good stuff here. And they are quite good. Mm, I don't want to complain, you know. <laughs> yeah. I can't say that, the, uh, that things here are very cheap. They are not very cheap. But I think they are affordable. Plus, uh, most of the stuff that you get here, you can't get it somewhere else, you know. So, I don't think you have to bargain when it comes to price. Look at the maid. I don't know how many weeks it has spent there. <laughs> and that is kiwi. It's my new favorite fruit now. <laughs> yeah. look at the avocado they're so small and they are not that like good that's what we get here in sweden by the way it doesn't matter which shop you go to the avocados are mm -mm. if you've been to africa and you've bought some avocados and you've you know eaten avocados then when you come here <laughs> it's a different situation everything change you know yeah, but I love the vegetable there. They're quite fresh, the bell peppers, spring onions. The tomatoes. <laughs> yeah, but the cucumbers were not that fresh, at least not on that day. They're quite dry and they looked so tired. <laughs> if I can use that word. Oh my god. And if you want to buy a big uh, tray of um, fajete, of eggs, then you have to go in one of them, of these shops, the Arabic shops. That's where they sell the big trays. In Swedish supermarkets, we have trays of eggs, but they are small. You don't get so many eggs. But they are there, and they are local and quite expensive. Can someone tell me the name of that specific vegetable that I'm holding? Because I don't know. I just buy them, but I don't know the name. I don't know the name in any language. I don't know. And then this section... Uh, I can see down there the um, garden eggplants. Um, you can't find this anywhere in Swedish supermarket. The garden eggplants. No, they are not there. You just find the normal eggplants. You know, another name for the ones I'm talking about is, we call it aubergine. <laughs> and this one, they say um, they are the garden eggplants eggplants that's what makes the difference i don't know but if you want them you have to go to an asian store or just 
the Arabic store to be specific. And then you will get a lot of chilies. Obviously, you know, people from Middle East, they eat a lot of spices. And like me, I don't want it to be too spicy. So guys, I'm going to uh, stop talking from here. Thank you so much for watching and uh, kindly subscribe, like, comment and share. And let's meet in another video. Take care guys. Bye.